Included in your order should be one blue shim, one inner clamp, two bolts, two knobs, one metal shim that is zip tied to the chainstay clamp, and one chainstay clamp. For a bike with an oval or rectangular chainstay that does not have a cable pocket, remove the metal shim from the chainstay clamp by pulling out the bolt and sliding it off like shown. This shim will not be needed. Wrap the blue shim around the chainstay frame like shown. This will keep the bike from getting scratched while also providing extra grip. Now, simply attach the leash by spinning the knobs onto the bolts like shown. Tighten the knobs as much as possible. The rounder the chain stay, the tighter the knobs must be. The clamp and shims will conform to the shape of the chain stay, so remember to tighten the knobs before each ride. Make sure the clamp cannot rotate. If it can, it needs more tightening. Check the space between the clamp and the chain. If it looks like the chain will rub the clamp, loosen the bottom knob and tighten the top knob on the chain stay clamp until there is no rubbing. For a bike with a cable pocket or similar anti-rotation feature, the metal shim should be left attached to the chainstay clamp. Wrap the blue shim around the chainstay frame like shown. This will keep the bike from getting scratched while also providing extra grip. Now, simply attach the leash by spinning the knobs onto the bolts like shown. Tighten the knobs as much as possible. The rounder the chainstay, the tighter the knobs must be. The clamp and shims will conform to the shape of the chainstay, so remember to tighten the knobs before each ride. Make sure the clamp cannot rotate. If it can, it needs more tightening. Check the space between the clamp and the chain. If it looks like the chain will rub the clamp, loosen the bottom knob and tighten the top knob on the chainstay clamp until there is no rubbing. If the bottom knob is at its loosest point and there is still not enough clearance, the blue shim can be wrapped around the chainstay frame like shown. Use the extra plate to keep the clamp on for quicker installation as shown here. Enjoy your rides.